Hey guys, um, so I wanted to come do an update for you guys because I haven't done a video uh, kind of in a while for me, I guess a little bit. And um, also because I'm going out of town tonight, um, I'm going with my mom and Joe and London and we're going uh, back east to Rhode Island. My mom's from Massachusetts and we used to go back every summer to go visit my grandma and family and we haven't been back um, since I think like 2004 or 2005 so it's been a long time so I'm really excited to go back and to see all my family um, so I'm gonna be gone for a week so I probably won't have a video up for a while um, I actually got tagged to do the would you rather video um, beauty edition um, not really into those kind of things I think that tag especially is a little juvenile a little bit but I'm gonna do it anyways um, just because I was tagged by Tiffany the one and only mixed cutie and then um, one of my one of you I can't remember your name sorry um, sent me a message and asked me to do it also so I'll probably do that um, while I'm gone and then upload it when I get back if I can um so so I'm really excited about the trip but I am a little nervous about taking London on the plane but uh, we leave tonight at 11.30, so it's like the overnight jet blue, so I think it'll be okay flying there, but flying back, it's like late in the evening, so I'll let you guys know how it, go, how it went. Um, so the other thing I want to talk to you guys about with my hair, um, as you can see, it's hard to tell because it's all dark, but um, I actually have been letting my hair air dry recently. Um, Miss Cafe Olay, she does, she does, puts her products in, lets it air dry, and then stretches her hair afterwards. So I've been noticing that my hair's been dry and frizzy, or not dry, but frizzy lately, and hasn't been retaining as much moisture. Um, so that's what I've been doing, is letting it air dry um, most of the part, and then just stretching it out afterwards, especially up here, because my layers at the top are really short. Um, like you can see, and this is stretched, so it's usually a lot shorter than this. And then the other next layer is like not till down here. So if I don't stretch it, it's like up here and it just kind of sticks straight out. And then this layer, it just looks a mess. So just letting it air dry, it's not really working. I really need this top layer to grow and I feel like it's not growing um, as quickly as the rest of my hair but I think part of the reason is because you know the top layer of your hair is what's exposed to all the elements to the sun um, you know you tend to kind of focus on the top hair more than the hair underneath and this hair is more protected because it's underneath so you might notice that the hair around your nape um, is a lot healthier um, but I, I need a haircut when I had my hair straight I'm seeing all my ends and they look kind of bad um, so I'm not sure if I want to tr cut it myself, um, to trim it or if I just want to wait, um, until it's been a year since I got my diva cut and then go back and get another haircut, um, because I really am concerned about these layers not growing and they're feeling a little raggedy at the end, but it's also because I do have a heat damage at the ends, of course, because I was wearing my hair straight so much, um, so, and then, like, a dying bleaching lightning dark light dark light you know all that so that's all on my ends so um, even though my hair is tons better I think that letting it air dry and then stretching it out after um, is a lot better for my hair also and I really like how it looks um, a lot more too and I've been using more oil than I was using before so um, so I like doing it that way if I have the time to do it. Um, it's a nice option. Um, also, when I showed you guys my all my products that I did, when I showed you, you know, my problem with having an excessive amount of products, a lot of you suggested doing like a yard sale kind of a thing. So soon um, I plan on doing something like that, um, doing it in like lots kind of so having four or five different products and then you buying the whole lot um, and then you know then you'd have to pay for shipping handling because I'm not gonna pay for that um, I could do individual products but that is so much work for the shipping and sending out my displays and seeing how much of a pain it is to do it that way I'm not gonna do that for you know like the 50 some odd products that I want to try and get rid of 
And also I want to say I don't throw away any of the products that I don't use. A lot of times I give it to my mom or to my friends because um, I have a couple of friends that have naturally curly hair also so I give them stuff too to try. Um, and then my mom and my dad too, I give him stuff too. Um, so watch out for that. I'm going to have that soon once I figure out um, how I'm going to group the products together. Um, also want to say that I had a YouTube date, that's what Joe called it, with African Export and we went to lunch and we went to the thrift store and went shopping and we had a lot of fun. I just wanted to say thank you African Export for spending the afternoon with me. I had a really wonderful time and I'm looking forward to our next YouTube date. Um, so that's pretty much all my updates for right now. Like I said, I'm going to be gone, so I might not do a video, um, so I won't have any videos that I'm uploading. I'm going to try and do a video soon about my like sleeping regimen, because a lot of people have been asking me how I sleep on my hair um, and how I get my second day hair, um, like exactly how I do it. So I'm going to do a tutorial on that soon when I come back. Um, and then I have the Would You Rather tag coming up soon, and then I'm gonna do the yard sale thing. And remember people, I have used some of these products, so if you're not interested in used products, then don't leave me a comment or don't participate. Um, but for those of you that don't have a problem with that, um, you know, watch out, that'll be coming soon. Um, I think that's it. I thought there was something else that I wanted to talk about, and I can't remember. Um, pretty sure that's it. Oh, my lipstick, because I'm, I'm sure a couple people are going to ask. This is Up The Amp. I got this from Taryn. This is like her everyday lipstick. It's beautiful. I love this. Um, it's Up The Amp, and then I have Bloom uh, Lip Liner, which is um, by um, NYX NYX Cosmetics. Um, so that's all. Um, I've been having like some issues with my hair with it being dry. It's annoying. Um, and it's getting really frizzy and we're going back east and it's like, you know, the humidity and the heat. So I'm really going to have to experiment a little bit more so my hair doesn't look like chia 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 because, uh, we know how it can get like that sometimes in the heat and humidity if you've ever been in the humidity before. So that's all guys. I'm really excited about my trip. We are going to, like I said, we're going to Rhode Island. Um, we were going to go to New York, but I guess we're not going to go anymore. I don't exactly know. <sighs> Anyways, so thank you guys. Thank you to all my new subscribers. Again, I keep getting more and more subscribers. It's really exciting. So hello, welcome. Thank you for subscribing and thank you for watching my videos and thank you for all of your support for all of you that, you know, uh, like watching my videos. I loves you. I loves you. All right, guys. Um, so I'll try and do a video soon. Joe has an iPhone and I know you can upload directly if you have an iPhone. So, um, maybe I'll be able to do, upload a couple of videos while I'm out there. Um, about anything. What else? Okay. Thank you guys. Bye.